Our live coverage from Indianapolis continues. Al Michaels reporting from ringside as Marvin Johnson in the white trunks and Leslie Stewart in the green trunks. Have at it for the WBA Light Heavyweight Championship. The crowd, obviously a pro Johnson crowd, very much into the fight here at Market Square Arena in downtown Indianapolis. Johnson born, raised, lives here. Now a deputy sheriff in Marion County. Johnson using that, that right jab, as we stated earlier, more as a range finder than anything else. It's not a stiff jab, not a particularly potent jab. Likes to use it to, to set up the left. And to set up the left uppercut if he can. Going some wild lefts here. Very shortly it becomes a question now of stamina for Bolt and in particular for Johnson as he approaches his 32nd birthday and after a furious early pace in this fight, especially in round one. Pace slowing here in round six on the part of both fighters. Good right off the ropes by Stewart. Johnson trying to come in with that left hand, and Stewart, as he's proven since the latter stages of round one, very effective in punching his way off the ropes and countering over that left hand. But that cut again has now opened up outside the right eye of Leslie Stewart. Blood perhaps inspiring Johnson a little bit more. Now the blood really screaming down. Johnson. And they're going to take a look at the cut. The referee, Priyami, who, as I say, does not speak English, is motioning Johnson, who has Stewart's blood streaming down his right arm. He summons the ring physician. William Puxwell in to take a look at the cut. Now early on, the cut, there was a cut outside the right eye of Stewart. Blood now screaming down the left side of his face as well. The ring doctor has taken a look. Very reminiscent of the Matthew Saad Muhammad confrontation when he was cut over both eyes when he was going as Matthew Franklin in his fight with Johnson. But they let it continue with blood screaming and no doubt somewhat obscuring the vision of Leslie Stewart as the round ends. We start the sixth round, the seventh round here in Indianapolis. Stewart's corner just above me, so I was looking at the work they were doing between rounds and he has now been cut near both eyes, the left and the right, and the one on the left eye appears to be the more serious of the two. The cut outside the right eye had been opened in round one. And they did not fully close the cut near the left eye now, and that begins to scream here in round seven. Johnson sensing a possible ending, picking up the pace, coming out quickly paced here in the seventh round. And he has to be careful 
history by becoming the first man to win the light heavyweight championship of the world three separate times. Twice now he has been the WBA champion. On the other occasion he was the WBC champion. He came 